finale of the Mustang Classic goes to the Spartans of York College, 11-8 over Stevenson. Glenn Clark now joined by Spartans head coach Brandon Childs. Coach, uh, pretty nice little weekend for you here in Owings Mills, huh? Yeah, yeah. To get two, you know, to get one win in a weekend is a pretty good thing to get two. Is a, I guess a great thing. So we'll take it. This game tonight, you were trailing 7-5 in the third quarter, and Billy Sasso came back in, and it seemed like everything seemed to change, and it just snowballed the other way. Yeah, you know, he's a great face-off guy, and we saw on film, uh, we kind of let coaching get in the way there. We saw on film uh, um, in their Ohio Wesleyan game, Ohio Wesleyan did a great job with the pole and the face-off, so we gave it a shot, and um, I finally just told you know, get the coach it out of the way and just trust <laughs> your players to do it, and then... Um, you know, we won all, all of them in the fourth quarter and winning every faceoff in the fourth quarter with the discipline we play at the offensive end, um, you know, got us right back into it. It changed everything, obviously, in the second half. Coach, you have a very young team. Uh, we were talking a little bit off the air before we started this about how these guys within that offense are taking care of business. And tonight was another example of that, that, that you have young players, but yet you can trust them in big spots. Yeah, you know, it's a, it's a really disciplined group, you know. And I told my team on Friday morning before we came down here that my goal was that at the end of the weekend, um, whether we went 2-0 and or 0-2, we'd go out of here with the reputation of being the most disciplined team. Um, and, um, you know, I think that that showed through uh, yesterday and then again tonight. Um, and just making disciplined decisions, you know, smart decisions with the ball. We're really smart in the clear. Um, and just, you know, being, being disciplined, you know. Yeah. And I thought we really, we really showed it tonight. I sensed a lot of emotion after the game was over from your team. Obviously, you've been building something at York, but is this sort of maybe like a marker of the progress that you've made to be able to come here and do something like this? Yeah, you know, I mean, we've come here and lost, you know. Um, we've been on the other end of this at, at this stadium quite a bit um, in, in my six years at yeah. York, you know, and um, so it meant a lot to, to our guys and um, to, to win one, you know, and um, um, so that's really what that emotion was about. And um, whenever you play – um, in this kind of environment, there's just a lot of emotion, you know, no and, and I guess what I would tell you is our guys work really, really hard, you know, and when they when when it pays off like that, they're going to show that kind of emotion. And it was our bench, you know, it was the guys on the bench that work so hard all week in practice um, to, you know, for scouting purposes and things like that, that don't get the reward. And then when the, their team wins. Um, you know, they're going to yeah. be pretty emotional. <laughs> no doubt about that. Coach, just uh, your experience again at the Mustang Classic. You've been a part of it for a little while, but can you just take us through what this event means for, for your team, for your program, for the entire sport? Yeah, I mean, it's unbelievable. I mean, what, what the people at Stevenson do, what Paul does here, um, you know, like – I'm tired right now, and all I did was coach the two games. He put the entire tournament on, and, um, you know, I was joking with him yesterday that, uh, you know, he probably doesn't see his family at all this weekend. Right. You know, I got to take my son to swim lessons this morning. So uh, um, so I had it easy compared to to Stevenson and everybody here that has to put on a whole tournament. And so we're, I'm very grateful for the work that they put in, not only Paul and his staff, but, but um, everybody from the people that are greeting us all the way through getting the stats delivered to me the second I walk um, off the field. Everything is done perfectly. Um, and I think Regardless of divisions one, two, or three, everybody's envious of what goes on this weekend, and we are very blessed and grateful to be able to play in it. Well, Coach, we're happy to have you again. Congratulations on a big win, and best of luck moving forward. Thanks a lot. I appreciate it. He's Coach Brandon Childs. I'm Glenn Clark. This has been GoMustangSports.com. <laughs>